Hello everyone! Can I get a margin like on the video? Muchas gracias. Okay, so as you can see from the title, the one Vegeta that nobody seems to ever use in Xenoverse 2, at least from my own personal experience, is Margin Vegeta. Now, yes, you do have you know, Vegeta's like the normal Vegeta, which would include Base, Super, the Resurrection of Red Vegeta, which doesn't even have Super Saiyan as of right now, Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta, which is actually used quite a bit, as well as Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta. Now, out of, I think it's like four different character slots for him, this is the one, as of right now, that pretty much isn't used. Um, and it's funny because I'm recording this a few hours after the Super Baby Vegeta 2 leak was revealed from, you know, V-Jump that was released in June of 2018. Completely unintentional. I didn't uh, plan this today. Or rather, I did plan this today, but I didn't know that that was going to be a character that would be revealed. Uh, so, yeah, who knows? Uh, so, I do go for the full power energy wave volley ultimate there into the mighty dandelion explosive wave as he went for the times 20 Kaioken Kamehameha ultimate and because of course given how little health he had that was more than enough to put that guy away. Now I do think that when Super Baby Vegeta 2 does come out unless he is absolutely trash which I don't think he will be but unless like they're just like completely nerf or well, not nerf like you know uh, just completely make him a joke like bad stats, bad skills, bad combo strings and stuff like that, I do think that it's going to be Margin Vegeta still that nobody picks. Maybe Duplicate Vegeta if he does get added in, maybe in Xenoverse 3 as an, alter, you know, an alternative costume, I don't know. I love how I went for the, was it, the, uh, what's that attack called? Uh, finish break, Breaker, fi uh, sorry, Finish uh, Breaker. I couldn't think of the name of it then. How all the attacks are missed. There goes for the Divine Lasso. Perfect block here. Oh, you filthy girl. Very nice right there. I uh, actually didn't, well, I either didn't know or completely forgot that you could perf well, technically what? perfect block uh, just, not just this combination. This isn't a Burke Hall place cheap video. <laughs> um, Divine Lasso. Uh, there, I do not know why I went for Final Explosion. I'm guessing I meant to go for the full power energy wave ultimate. Yeah, I completely failed there. Just go for the super black coming out of the Rose. I mean, I couldn't do anything. I could technically go for my limit burst, which. I think on both presets, because there are two presets of Margin Vegeta, Margin Daddy, I need help. Um, I think, at least on this one right here, but it might be on both, the limit burst effect is auto stamina and auto health regeneration. Very nice right there. They went for the Warp Divine Retribution. You can, as well as the Instant Transmission Savage Strike, you can perfect block both of those, but it's a weird timing and you need to be set up in a specific way. There goes the yes. Divine Lasso again. I could have just blocked it, then teleported behind him into a heavy... Well, not a heavy... Well, I guess I could have gone for a heavy standard break or a heavy smash, but I do. I uh, decided not to because if you guys watched that uh, clip back then, I did have, like, I think one and I think, a, you know, one and a quarter bars of uh, stamina. So it wouldn't really have been in my best interest. So I decided not to. Very nice right there. Of course, these are all going to be play matches and rank matches with and without you not leaving a like. Oh, double reverse psychology, double negatives, filthy. Uh, leave a like anyway. Uh, but with and without limitations on and off, so very nice. So this is this fight right here is going to go to a time out. So of course, it's going to last for three minutes. I've said this before. Can we please have it so? Regardless of what match type you're in, play match, endless, ranked, etc, etc, um, and what the settings are, by default, can we please have it so each fight lasts for a, well, has the potential to last for five minutes, not three minutes. Let me know in the comments, guys, do you, is that something that you want, or don't, or don't you care, or do you think three minutes per battle, by default, is a good time? I would like to know, maybe I could send that to spank my Namco, what? <laughs> Okay, um, but yeah, uh, Mouse and Avatar, I don't actually think it's going to transform, or if it does, I think it might have potential unleashed, but I believe, oh yeah, I'll go from uh, Final Explosion there. I, I was thinking, at least I think I was thinking, thinkception, that the Final Explosion would have reached him, it didn't, there, he goes for a stamina break, I did, technically speaking, I did technically block it, 
But here's the thing, I had extremely lost down there to the point where pretty much everything would have well, I guess with the exception of key blasts, I think I don't like it or not. But basically, anything and everything would have been able to break my guard. But I do get stamina reset. Kind of got away with it, but he is running as you guys saw earlier on. Perfect shot. Okay, fantastic. We, it needs to be changed, in my opinion, so you can vanish out of it. Like if you, um, if he comes towards you, I don't think you can right now. You have to use your invasive. Of course, that's going to take a grand total of three bars of stamina. A very overpowered attack. Uh, especially if you are a key based character. I think I did a video on it in the past, if not, maybe I should, because seriously, it is, it's, it's, Perfect Shot is one of those, yeah, one of those attacks that is typically, for the most part, not in every situation, but it's yes. typically something yes. that is considered a cheap attack because of the fact that, well, if it's comboed into by a uh, gravity impact, like the, uh, I guess like the uh, full distance, where you, until you can actually like, you know, do something, it's exceptionally long. Uh, it seems like it's a bit of an oversight or something, maybe it's not, but, I mean, don't get me wrong, uh, gravity impact into perfect shot, extremely effective and very powerful. Again, especially if you are a key base character. I may do a video on that now. I did do a video on gravity impact about, I don't know, you can see in the bottom right hand corner, Right now, men of a gentle nature and lads. Um, but yeah, okay, so before I continue, there's like a few seconds left now. He goes for a final come on my heart. He must have yes. panicked there. Like, what's his other ultimate? Divine Lasso. I don't know if he went for it because he knew that he wouldn't be able to do anything in those, you know, like, like, um, those few seconds to do enough damage on me, so he would win by default. But oh man, that got really damn close. But like I was saying, Gravity Impact and perfect and all Perfect Shot, extremely powerful to the point where they, like, they are, by definition, overpowered lads. During the Dandelion now, uh, play match, items turned on, I think, he's not, I don't think he uses them, uh, level 90 or 99, uh, time is set to a cheeky 15 minutes. Lads, very nice right there. So, someone's going to win by KO. Uh, this guy was a bit of a disappointment towards the end, and when what I'm about, well, when it happens, you'll know exactly what I'm talking about and what I mean. So, I forget exactly what both these presets of the uh, Margin Vegeta have, but on this one right there, it's the final explosion preset, two ultimates, final explosion, the full power energy wave ultimate, uh, explosive wave as his trans, uh, sorry, as his evasive, no transformation, slash, awoken, uh, full auto, uh, full suit, I can't talk, four supers, maximum charge, you can see right there, maximum charge, atomic blast, um, Meteor Crash and Finish Breaker, or Finish, whatever it's called, I don't know. Uh, <laughs> the Barrage Key, that's one. There, I go for Final Explosion, it completely misses. Uh, he did go for Meditation into the damn Power Impact, I'm thinking, oh, damn it. I go for my Limit Burst, thankfully, like I said earlier, the Limit Burst gives me Auto Stamina, but for that specific situation, what I really wanted was the Auto Health Recovery, and you can see right here, it's still recovering my health. Thank God. If I didn't go for my low burst, I would have literally been KO'd at this point and he would have won the battle. Oh man, power impact. Oh, power, power rush, isn't it? Yeah, that's that's the one. Uh, finish breaker, that's the one I meant as well. Seriously, man. Uh, yeah, nice force hit there. I do hope when that uh, net cold patch fix, whatever comes out, he stops stuff like that. So, of course, for some random reason, he then goes for his limit burst, which, of course, because it's Jiren, and because he's got the this heat, will be you leaving a comment? Oh, yes! On the video, lads, uh, the, uh, <laughs> this heat will be your downfall. He's going to have auto just guard. So, you can see right here, you know, right here I'm trying to get him in a grab. A Gallic impact, I think the grab is technically uh, technical. There you go, some 4 yes. energy wave. I got from mine as well, the exact same ultimate. Uh, if Beam Clash is winning the game, that would have really helped me out, unless I was trashed at the... Um, fun fact, in Ultimate Tenkaichi, I was awful at uh, uh, countering yes. a Beam Super or Beam Ultimate by using... You know, by Beam... I was bad at Beam Struggles, that's what I meant to say. Um, so I do go for Final Explosion here. He's in the water, he's going to be drowned. Very disgusting and that is going to do just about well or rather i have yeah i had just enough stamina to maintain it long enough so that would ko him and he rage quits that, that it was a shame they did disconnect i thought that was actually in my opinion i think that was the best fight uh, that i had while recording this and of course the best fight in this video final fight now merged daddy oh you filthy Kyoshin, okay. Uh, 
Oh man. Okay, now I do go for the grab again. Again, I think it's called Gallic Impact or something like that. Or Gallic Burst, I can't remember. But we've got this very much right there. Fun fact. Fun facts, rather. Uh, Xenoverse what? tips, trick. <laughs> I can't talk. Then we try that again. Xenoverse tips, tricks, trivia, and history <laughs> with Daddy Deluxe um, in the Xenoverse 1 betas or the network tests, as they were officially called, I guess. Um, Male, well, I don't know if it's female Saiyans, but male Saiyan avatars before Thrall was Vegeta's. The uh, Raditz one wasn't added um, added in, so until I think at the latest, until the game was actually officially released, and we've had that exact same grab what? above Xenoverse 1 and 2 ever since. So, I did break his guard into the mid to crash here. Yeah, that's gonna be, well, it's gonna be game in a moment. I've not got any key or stamina. I've almost got one bar of stamina, so I have got that, I guess. But he, I mean, yeah, um, again, it is going to be game any second. Now, yeah, I'll go for the grab again, and that is game. Okay, very nice right there. Guys, with that said, thank you ever so much for watching this video. I do honestly hope you enjoyed it. Again, thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. I don't know what I was trying to say there. Leave a